Good morning viewers. I am Veena Iswaradas teaching in the Department of Psychology Women's Christian College. The course we propose to offer is titled Clinical Psychology. Clinical Psychology is one of the core disciplines in the field of psychology. This field has grown tremendously in the last 50 years both in theory and in practice. However, although the number of practitioners in general and clinical psychologists in specific has been on the increase, there is still a great gap between the therapist to patient ratio in this field. As the number of mental health problems are increasing due to stresses in lifestyle and changes in patterns of work and social functioning, there are a number of problems which have been arising in the present society. Clinical psychologists attempt to treat, identify, diagnose and prevent mental illness and promote mental health. Clinical psychologists today and in the future will play an important role in advancing well-being and in promoting optimal functioning in society. The course that we propose to answer or the course that we propose to offer will be over 60 hours during a semester. It will carry four credits and be offered at the postgraduate level. I will be the course coordinator and will bring to this course 27 years of postgraduate teaching experience and 20 years of clinical psychology practice. The eligibility for this course will include students who have completed a graduate program majoring in psychology or students with a triple major or double major including a major in psychology. The course objectives are to provide students with a structured framework for understanding symptoms of mental disorders and to give a broad framework of the DSM-5 in the diagnosis of mental disorders. At the end of the course, students will be able to recognize manifestations of symptoms of mental disorders and to objectively assess clinical symptoms based on DSM-5. The course outline is presented here. It has an introductory unit on clinical psychology, its nature and scope and training and introduction to classificatory systems of mental disorder. Unit 2 looks at anxiety based disorders, trauma and stress related disorders, somatoform disorders and dissociative disorders. Unit 3 will give an orientation to affective disorders and psychotic disorders. Unit 4 to neurodevelopmental, conduct, personality disorders and feeding and eating disorders. The final unit will look at substance related disorders, sexual dysfunctions, gender dysphoria and uh, paraphilic disorders. There will be some practicum in this course. It will be uh, analysis of case studies and case work in a mental health setting. At the end of this course, students will be familiar and oriented to mental disorders. Thank you.